I don't want to talk about my hand. I don't want to talk about my hand. Hey! Oh, wow! By the time you get to the office, I can't wait to talk about my hand. Mommy, breakfast is the most important meal of the day. In fact, any time I don't eat breakfast, I feel as if my brain is not working. And does your brain even work, even when your tummy is full? Like, just because my body burns fat and yours keeps it. Right. And let me use my fat hand to slap your slim brain so that I can reset. Ah, me, Mommy. Yes. I don't even understand that one Shakara again at all. Uh -uh. Instead of you to simply tell him how you feel so that you can move on. Uh. Me, Shalewa, tell a man how I feel about him first. God forbid. Never. Hey, Nyama Ah, uh -uh. Hey, but we are desperate. Shuba. Not like your own, no, Daddy. Who? Don't worry. Your papa. He will call you, then you shall he will do shakara. Exactly. Then he will call you again. Mm -hmm. Small, small. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's how you be advising her with this kind of drama, ba? That she did one the other day and was acting as if she was suffering from epilepsy. Ah, don't sweat for me, I beg it was not epilepsy. What is that? Abu. Egbami. Honestly, it's the best policy. Just simply tell him how you feel. And you that you're hiding your feelings for me, day. When you tell me day how you're feeling about it, then come back and advise me. This is different. Koyato, Koyato. Mm mm, Koyato. Wo, Shori. Let me tell you, Tualade. If you want me to love you, just come to me for advice. Wo, Timba, for any advice, if you need by, they will just fall in love, love, okay? Okay. And all the planning, advising, and all you've been doing since with Kola and Femi. Who your plan don't help now, mommy? Okay. Are you now saying my plan did not work? Okay. Did I call you? My filomin dasi. Ellen no short cross. Mommy, that's how you be doing every time when you know I'm right. You not be beaten about this. Yes. That's your grandmother too, or there. I'm my mother's daughter. This is what you go and give them as an excuse in your office. Sure. Ah, ah, Jesus, you didn't even tell me I you were I know I was here just in. Am I your accurate timekeeper? I'm not saying you just need to be too. I get us. You can hear your ring, you can hear on that you are not going near pumping. Ah, you are wicked. I beg you. Kilo she la te contact so ro o le so fun. Bo ti le ti de. She wa fe ki won le ni bi she ni. Are you not the same person that said I should be minding my business? So I do not put my mouth in you people's business now. Ah, it's your business. Oh, uh -uh. Jesus. It's Lord. Forever and ever. Amen. Oh, that you are more sure. Holy. Like I see, you know, this woman doesn't know that her hand is painful. They always behave like that every time they know I'm right. They never listen. See? I'm not going to let these people get to me today. Oh. Boom. They will not hear from my mouth. It's all about me. Chill. What's going on in the office? Why are you pacing up and down? I've been What's waiting for you since now. Uh, have you seen Oga? No, which Oga? Are you talking about Mide? Because he called me, but like... I'm, I'm not talking about Mide. I'm talking about Kate. Did you see my missed calls and all my messages? My phone was on silent. I went running. But you can't be doing things like this now. There might be emergencies. Ah, anyway, have you spoken to him? No, I haven't. Why? I don't know how to say this, but... Babes, eh? There's a scandal brewing and I really, really need you to be calm. I'm calm now. Tell me what's going on or should I go on in the Ikeja and check? Yes, you can go on there to check. But see, eh? I need you to tell me this and tell me the truth. And pro I promise you, I will believe you and nobody else. Did you take money from Mike Anderson to play his songs? What? I knew it. I knew that it was a lie. See, there's this expose article on air, on air personalities taking money from artists to play their songs. And your name was the only name mentioned from this radio station. Wait, did Mike Anderson say I took money from him? 
No, he didn't say so. But there is a source that says they were there when he was giving you money and you took it and just... I just, I just knew that it was Elisha. I knew it. I knew. I knew it was Elisha. <laughs> of course I didn't. I would never do that. Mike came to the office to premiere his music and I decided to interview him. I liked the song. I played it a few times afterwards. He came over one day and brought lunch and flowers to the office to give me. Hadiza was in the office and she was a bit upset with the fact that he was not paying her attention. But... The, What is it? No, Hadiza would never do that. What? Do you think Hadiza will be the source? A little bitch. No, 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 she would never do that. <laughs> Tiwa, wait, wait, I don't understand. Why do you always keep supporting this girl? Why? I don't get it. No, that's taking things too far. But why would you always support her? I don't understand you. <sighs> do you know what that means? Mm. The famous Tiwa. Madam, the madam of all scandals. If you are not trying to sleep with your boss, you are collecting payola. Uh, uh. Hadiza. Yes, Tiwa, wait. Hadiza. You see, every time I keep telling Tiwa that you are a jealous little lowlife, but no, mm -mm. she will always try to treat you like a human being. See, eh, let me tell you, I'm going to do my own private investigation. And if I find out, that you are the source of this rubbish. You are finished, believe me. Hadiza, how did I ever offend you? You first of all get me fined. Then you go around destroying my person and my character. To the point that even the GM sees me as a pain. Hadiza, understand that this is your position that you are at now. It will not last forever. Oh. When you mess up and trust me, you will. I will be there personally to nail your coffin. If I find out that you're the source, I will destroy you. And you will hate me deeply. Hmm. I'm not going to say okay. much. I may or may not be the source. But no matter what, Viola is a very bad way to live. Change, Tiwa! I'll play the game better. The GM would like to see you now. Hmm? Look, babe, don't worry. I'll make a few phone calls. This girl is done. Isn't Hadiza taking this thing a bit too far? Is it the whole midday thing? I mean, it's one thing to keep this within us in the office, but to lie and take it publicly? I will not accept this from Hadiza. I will not accept this. Good afternoon, ma. What's good about this scandalous afternoon? Ma, I have no idea how I got mixed up in this scandal. You seem to think I want to hear your lies. Ma, I have no reason to lie to you. So how much did you collect? I did not collect any form of money. So what did you collect? Nothing. He came over to the office, in show of appreciation, gave me flowers and lunch. You seem to think this is a joke. Ma, I did not collect anything. I have a record of how many times you played that song, and it wasn't even on the schedule. I loved the song. But it wasn't even a hit, and you played it so many times. There's no way there wasn't a payoff involved in this. Ma, I insist, and again and again, I did not collect anything. Hmm? When I saw them together, I was like, ah, what's going on here? Is it for the station or what? But it was just for her. She collected God knows what. And now we have a useless scandal on our hands. Ma, the scandal is on our hands because of Hadiza. The minute she heard the story, she did not bring it to you. Inside it says, move from station to station to blogs. Ma, I insist again and again, I did not do anything wrong. <sighs> of course. Put the blame on me for collecting goods for an illegal service. Enough. Tiwa, you'll be suspended for two weeks until I can fully investigate the matter. Hadiza? What? I'll also be investigating how the story reached the blogs. But, you have been implicated. Ma, ma this, this has nothing to do with how the report got out, but the fact that Tiwa was... The fact that this story came out of this office is unacceptable, and I will be investigating. <laughs> I'm very happy, ma, that you shall be doing this investigation. But it shall bring to light the fact that I am innocent and that someone evil is behind this. Someone who is malicious, callous, and jealous. You're both dismissed. Have you confessed? I have 
nothing to confess. Hadiza, why are you so mad at me? What have I done to you? Please tell me so that I can apologize. Mm. You're so innocent, huh? Eh? You always think you can do no wrong. What's with this innocent talk? I have never once claimed to be innocent. All I try to do is be the better version of myself. You, on the other hand, you've made it your sole purpose to try and destroy me. And I want to know why. Tia, you humiliated me. Every single chance you got. You knew I wasn't with it. Yet you sat there listening to the stories I was telling you. Allow me to arm that, that Didi with armor to insult me. And as if that wasn't enough. I actually thought you were genuine when I had my social media drama. But no, you used it to make fun of me. And then you used your relationship to become head of programs. Something I wanted. Hadiza, say this is true. Now that you have that position, what have you done with it? To whose benefit is this except yours? You become power drunk, malicious and callous. No, tell me, now that you have it, what have you done with it? I... Exactly. Nothing. You have done nothing, Hadiza. If I were you, I would go in there and I would confess to Kate and tell her the truth. So I can come back and start work. And like I said, if I've done anything to you, tell me and I would apologize to you. If not, you owe me an apology, Hadiza. Mommy. Come on. Leo, mo. Mm -hmm. Ah. What happened? You are home early. Eh, Shishani. I forgot I took some days off to just rest. Rest, ke? She won't even ask Oja. It's a paid vacation now. I just took a few days. Ah, Oda Koburu. Wo, eh, mo she she ru e for kantoni. Eh, wo kitchen. Eh, wari. Eh, e for pokoto momo. Panla, a cake to fe. What is she at the bed? She, mammy. Hello, she. Hey, Minnie. Yeah. <laughs> What's well, what are you doing? Ah, me and mommy go out, so she buy me phone. You ah. bought her a phone? Hey, ah, I bought her a phone. Ah, eh, show mo. Mama, ni, go see. Kolo, we can't wait at the fridge. Kieja, kole, kole, yo. Mani, kolo, muru at the bubawa. I cannot see, go see. So I bought her a phone. I don't want to be waiting uh, till I come back before I tell her to do something. I want her on a free call. Okay. So who will teach her how to use the phone? Ah, uh, mommy is teaching me now. Now you are the one teaching her to use phone. Yeah, no, so kilo a phone. She mo wa mo phone uli. You that the other day you were still I was still helping you send text message that you couldn't even click the send button. You are the one that wants to teach someone how to use phone. Ben we done it, Jerry. Kill on she one more ago. No, who can she go and cut you? Do by way, we let no man so. Sure, 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 sure. Eh, eh, she can't take my auntie. Auntie, what lady? That phone, to for me. Uh huh. Sure, it's complicated, you. Ah, oh no. Ah, who? Eh, me recent button. Mo press here, boy. Uh huh. Go send. Do by law. Up. Do to law. Down. Do law. Up. Oh law. Down. No button send the lower side. Oh send the lower side. Oh for me, I was confusing you, Jari. Okay, that's fine now. So just give it to me, and I'm gonna buy you one that you understand. Ah, you know, you know, ah, no, 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 no. Ah, ah. that I took to church. Oh, <laughs> when I brought the phone out, I want to snap a picture. Everybody in the she will go on Saturday. Don't you want to share? Why, 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 Taking picture. Eh. Mm. Why do you see me? Why do you see me? Why do you see me? Why do you see it? It's for free. <laughs> <laughs> I want a video. No, mommy, it's called WhatsApp. What? 
and it's not for free. He uses data. Eh? Eh? Yeah. Ah. Hey, what of if they call me? Go. Same thing. Ah, Modano, Mogbe, Mogbe, Mogbe. Ah, Mogbe, Motigbe. Ah, Babe has been calling me. Let her come. Oh, what's up? Watch out to me. Why, 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 why? I'm going to say for free. He did not tell me. <laughs> ah. I am the one that wants to teach somebody how to use phone. Wait, no. Ah. Oh, yeah, did I teach you camera? No, Hello? It's a mistake, no, no, mistake. I'm Let me go somewhere know. private to talk to you. Yeah. Hold on. Who did that? Uh -huh. Yakosi. Yakosi. Okay, I can talk now. Then answer the question I just asked. I'm sorry, that was rude of me. Things just got out, out of hand. My phone was on silent. I saw your missed call, but then I thought you were calling to bug me. By the time I got to the office, I found out about the scandal. It's been crazy. I literally just got home now, and I said I was going to call. Explanation noted. Now what I want to know is why you did this. What could he possibly give you that you couldn't afford? And if you even couldn't afford something at the, at the moment, you'd have asked me. <laughs> Number one, I'm highly disappointed that you would think so low of me. To the point of not even calling me to find out the truth. And then number two, if I ever needed anything, you'll be the last person on earth I will ask. Wow. Oh, all right. I, I, I'm sorry. That, that was wrong. I, I mean, I told Kate that I doubted you did it. But when she told me about your suspension, it was enough confirmation for me. But I had told her to investigate before, before all this. Wow. Then you should have called me to find out, first of all, before me coming to a conclusion. If anything else, during this entire scandal, this phone call right now hurts the most. You are. Come on. Come on. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Okay? It's okay. I didn't do it. And I know the investigation will prove it. Thanks for your trust. Goodbye. You are. Auntie, your friend is here. Which friend? One man. Come here for birthday. I caught the phone on you. I don't understand why you're... You cut the phone on who? Hey. Hi. So, is it a good thing that I'm here? It's a good thing. How did you know, Tom? Well, I didn't hear you on the air. And I heard about the whole scandal, so I kind of imagine that you'd just be here hiding under a blanket. Well, no blanket, though. <laughs> I see. Well, I bought comfort food. <laughs> She's like cakes and ice cream. Oh, well, that's, that's nice of you to come. I thought we'd go outside to eat. Okay, sure. Yeah. See what to. So upset. So proper mad right now. <sighs> I can't imagine how tough today was for you. The toughest. <laughs> well, did you tell your mom? Oh, hell no. Uh -uh. I don't want to saddle her with that kind of information. Partly because I knew that. It's going to clear up real soon. Look, let's not concentrate on all that, okay? Let's concentrate on some cupcakes, right? <laughs> Amen to that. Thank you. At least you believed me. <laughs> Madam, holier than thou. Take a penny to play a song. I can't believe it. Holier than thou? You too? Oh, you act it. <laughs> but we're all flawed. I've seen you be naughty, but most of the time you're good. You don't let anyone live it down. I need to make a conscious effort when it comes to this. I never want people to think that, you know, I'm a self-righteous person. Look, you're not that bad. Me? I can manage you. You can manage me. <laughs> and if I'm going to manage you, you better pay dowry. <laughs> not only pay dowry, I'll propose. <laughs> and I want a big diamond too, I'm not playing. Does Nathan have two heads? He came over, he believed me. But me day, no, never. I was so disappointed in that phone call. Anyways, nothing cupcake cannot solve. So, how's your sister's wedding planning going? You are friends, right? 
Mm-hmm. Okay. I think it's proper for our significant others to know each other. Right? Okay. So, I propose that we hang out, all of us. So what, a double date? Mm-hmm. I think it's a perfect opportunity for me to know how perfect you and Nathan are and how I don't even stand a chance again. Okay. So name, place, where? Great. Great. Great.